reminder to stay safe as you head outside and you head to the water this 4th of July. Happy Independence Day, Southwest Florida. Today, though, for a lot of us, it is all about the red, white, and blue, those fireworks, hot dogs, and, of course, our freedom. This is Week News at 3. I'm Claire Galt in for Nicole Gate. And I'm Liz Byra in for Russ McCaskey. We're celebrating America's birthday like only Florida can at the best beaches in the world. Now, stop one. We have Fort Myers Beach. That's where we find Week News reporter Annalise Iraola. You join us live right on the sand. Annalise, what's shaking out there? Claire and Liz, Fort Myers Beach is packed full of people celebrating America's Independence Day. You know, because of the damage and destruction from Ian, some people might not want to come out here, but that has not stopped the people from coming out here today to celebrate their 4th of July celebrations. We've talked to locals, tourists, individuals. We've even seen some dogs out here. You name it, they are here. Some might say the lack of infrastructure stops them from coming, but it seems Fort Myers Beach has everything people are looking for on their Independence Day. We've got the beach, boats, and beverages. Families here playing out in the water, people decked out in their patriotic gear. I spoke with folks about why they chose Fort Myers Beach for their 4th of July celebrations and why this day is important to celebrate. I love this beach. Even after all this destruction, it's still beautiful. Because I believe in our freedoms and our independence and all that. I think it's a great holiday. Oh, it's a good time. I mean, good people out here, good energy, good environment, and uh, Good times, good vibes. We're the best, just no explanation. I think we live in the best country there ever was. Um, we can do whatever we want, when we want. Three. America! <laughs> So as you heard, the patriotism is in full swing here. If you want to check out the fireworks show on Fort Myers Beach, that starts at 9 p.m. But it's important to note that the Matanzas Pass Bridge will close at 8.30 tonight. So if you want to come out here for the fireworks, make sure you come here before that time. Live on Fort Myers Beach, Annalise Iraola, Wink News. All right, thank you, Annalise.